Well, today's soap is going to be inspired by the ninth state, New Hampshire, abbreviated NH, became part of the United States on June 21st, 1788. New Hampshire's nickname is the Granite State. Their motto is live free or die. And their anthem is Old New Hampshire. So the colors we're gonna be using in our soap today are Green Vibrance, Lilac, Fragrance, True Lilac, Special ingredients are going to include lilac infused olive oil. I actually have three full jars of this. Powdered sugar, pumice powder, and kaolin clay. I read on Wholesale Supplies Plus that this fragrance does not accelerate, rice, discolor, or separate. I am already very skeptical because usually Floral fragrances accelerate or do something. I'm going to guess accelerate because reading a few of the reviews, some people mentioned their batter accelerated. So I'm prepared for some acceleration. So are you ready to learn something about New Hampshire while creating a soap? I sure am. All right, here we go straining our olive oil that is infused with lilac. This is my first time using an infused oil. The capital of New Hampshire is Concord. And the big question is how is New Hampshire named? It was named by Captain John Mason after Hampshire, England. So this is the New Hampshire. The citizens of New Hampshire are referred to as New Hampshireites. Now New Hampshire's flag consists of the state seal centered on a blue background. The state seal depicts the frigate USS Raleigh and is surrounded by a laurel wreath with nine stars. Raleigh is one of the first 13 warships sponsored by the Continental Congress for a new American Navy. Now here we're about to add our fragrance oil, pumice powder, kale and clay, and our sugar. The wreath is an ancient symbol of fame, honor, and victory. The nine stars within the wreath show that New Hampshire was the ninth state to join the Union. The water stands for the harbor at Portsmouth. And the yellow colored bit of land is granite, a strong igneous rock representing both New Hampshire's rugged landscape and the sturdy character of her people. New Hampshire's state colors are orange, red, and yellow. Now you're wondering why is Shauna making a soap that is lilac themed? Well, keep listening. New Hampshire's state bird is the purple finch. Their amphibian is the red spotted newt. Their insect is the seven spotted ladybug. New Hampshire's butterfly is the Carner Blue Butterfly. Now here we go pouring our soap batter into the mold and you can certainly see there is acceleration. New Hampshire's state dog breed is the Chinook, another dog breed that I have never heard of. They've got two state fish, the Brook Trout and the Striped Bass. We have seen these fish over and over again in our previous states as state fish. Very popular on the East Coast so far. New Hampshire state flower is the purple lilac. Now you know where my inspiration went. New Hampshire's state mammal is the white-tailed deer and the bobcat. Their state tree is the American white birch. Their mineral is the barrel. Their rock is granite. Their gemstone is smoky quartz. Their state vegetable is the white potato. Their state fruit is the pumpkin. Interesting to think of it as a fruit, but yes. Their state beverage is apple cider, and their main economy sources come from dairy, beef, chicken eggs, greenhouse plants, hay, maple syrup, sweet corn, potatoes, apples, sand, gravel, and granite. One day later, here we are, ready to cut our soap. Now I don't think I'm totally alone in the florals aren't my favorite fragrance department. The lilac's really good. This true lilac fragrance is a different floral. It's very soft and nice. Pretty easy to unmold. Nice big purple loaf of soap here. Here we go, slicing off the edge. Air pockets. I kind of expected I was going to get air pockets. I did bang it down, but I guess I needed to continue to. 
And I'm really happy with the design already. That's what I was kind of going for is it was going to be mostly that light lilac purple with just little splashes of tiny bits of white throughout to kind of go for what the actual flower petals look like. And then the green, of course, is to represent the bush portion of a lilac bush. Continuing on with my movie related to the state. There are actually two movies that I have seen and like and recommend that take place in New Hampshire. First of all, Jumanji. It's a 1995 film that takes place in Brantford, New Hampshire. This is a great fantasy adventure film with a board game that comes to life. The movie that I particularly want to mention because I like it more than Jumanji is What About Bob? What About Bob is in 1991. American comedy film directed by Frank Oz. What about Bob stars Bill Murray and Richard Dreyfus. Bill Murray plays Bob Wiley. So what about Bob is about a man who becomes irritatingly attached to his psychotherapist that he's only met once. The patient's name is Bob Wiley. The psychotherapist's name is Dr. Leo Marvin. Bob tracks down and follows Dr. Leo Marvin on his vacation to New Hampshire. New Hampshire? So Bob shows up at his doctor's vacation home where his whole family is, and his family just loves Bob. And Dr. Marvin begins to just hate Bob. And the whole journey from meeting Bob to the end of the movie is so funny. About four days later, trimmed up our sides, filled in the air pockets, side stamp. Fragrance remains delicious. It almost has slightly minty after smell, <laughs> if that's a phrase. Because, you know, like aftertaste, well... You smell it and it smells like lilac and then when you're done smelling it there's this little hint of kind of a mintish or almost like a black licorice mintish type smell very different very unique i like it floral when you're smelling it minty black licorice when you stop smelling it now the main question for my viewers have you ever been to new hampshire no i haven't never now we're gonna end the video with a short less than 10 second clip from What About Bob, because if it's longer than 10 seconds, you get a copyright strike. After that, I will, if you are interested, let you listen to the anthem for New Hampshire. It's, it is a toe tapper. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Mmm. 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 Hey, this is so scrumptious. Is this hand shocked? Of New Hampshire's granite hills Old New Hampshire, old New Hampshire Old New Hampshire, grand and great We will sing of old New Hampshire Of the dear old granite state Builded he New Hampshire glorious From the borders to the sea with matchless charm and splendor Blessed her for eternity Hear the majesty of the mountain Hear the grandeur of the lake Hear the truth as from the hillside When Sir Crystal waters break Oh, New Hampshire, oh, New Hampshire Grand and great, we will sing of old.